The Affordable Care Act. Video 4. The Individual Mandate Exemptions. The individual mandate, also known as the shared responsibility provision, requires everyone to have health insurance or potentially pay a penalty for non-compliance. Starting in 2014, everyone will be required to maintain minimum essential coverage for themselves as well as their dependents. I feel like we've seen that one before. Anyhow, do you have any more questions about the individual mandate before we move along? Yes. Are there any exemptions from having to maintain minimum essential coverage? Sure, let's go through them. The mandate. You are exempt if you have no filing requirement because your household income is below the minimum threshold for filing a tax return, if a health insurance marketplace has certified that you have suffered a hardship that makes you unable to obtain coverage, if you can't afford coverage because the minimum amount you must pay for the premiums is more than 8% of your household income, if you went without coverage for less than three consecutive months during the year, if you are neither a U.S. citizen, a U.S. national, nor an alien lawfully present in the U.S., if you are a member of a religious sect that is recognized is consciously opposed to accepting any insurance benefits, if you are a member of a recognized healthcare sharing ministry, if you are a member of a federally recognized Indian tribe, or if you are in jail, prison, or similar penal institution or correctional facility after disposition of charges against you. Should I commit a crime and go to prison? <laughs> no, 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 I would not recommend that. The Acosta Insurance Group, answering the change. 